back pressure. He's going to run me up to my feet. I'm going to turn that arm through. This little flank right here is what I call it. This position is what creates the separation for me to now get a lift. Now, if he doesn't, right, if he over pursues, if he's driving in hard, when I have this flank and I got that shoulder underneath, kind of just drive in real hard, right? He does that. Now, I can kind of peek out and use that flank to get to a takedown position or do something cool, right? Big CS, I can throw him. If I get to this underhook, this position right here, I got a lot of options, right? If I'm driving here, where he drives in, right? Now I can. Damn! Whistle, seal, grab fingers. It's like one second, two seconds. Right there, roll that hand out, back pressure, drive that shoulder up. Three, four, I'm on my feet. Now I'm aggressive. All right, so it's pretty simple, right? Bottom isn't complicated. Sammy, you're riding okay, right? Bottom's not complicated. It is a couple consistent habits, and you're out every time. If you get really good at this, you know, a lot of you guys are pretty young. By the time you guys get to high school, you'll be really quick to get out on bottom. So again, seal, other hand seals, thumb up, or palm up, thumb out, smack his hand. Don't look at it, right? I'm gonna see a lot of you guys look like this. Do I have the hand, right? Don't put your head down, because if he's a good top wrestler and he's driving you forward, your head looking down, you're going down. Which is fine, we can recover from that and get the hand. But keep your head and chest up. Stay solid in your base. Right there, pull that out. Step that foot out. Turn that toe down. From there, I'm back pressuring. If he's not driving into me, then I'll just start to kind of create distance by getting my hips away. But most good top wrestlers are gonna be back pressuring. So right here, I drive that foot out. He's back pressuring. He's gonna run me up to my feet. I'm gonna turn that arm through. This little flank right here is what I call it. This position is what creates the separation for me to now get a lift. Now, if he doesn't, right, if he over pursues, if he's driving in hard, when I have this flank and I got that shoulder underneath, kind of just drive in real hard, right? He does that. Now, I can kind of peek out and use that flank to get to a takedown position or do something cool, right? Big CS, I can throw him. If I get to this underhook, this position right here, I got a lot of options, right? If I'm driving here, Braden drives in, right? Now I can. Damn!